Hello everybody, my name is Marty, and welcome to Kingdoms and Castles. This is a really fun, simple kind of medieval city builder. And uh, you have to take care of your people, provide them food, provide them water for putting out fires, provide them charcoal, provide them tools and weapons and so on and so forth. So once you get all that stuff, then you'll get raiders and stuff like that. So you have to build up protection around your castle. Um, it's really cool, and it's an early access game. And we're going to hop right into it. Into We'll go standard mode. We'll do that. We'll go no threats. Vintar. We'll try hard. And now we have to pick our city, or actually starting map. So I believe there's a couple different types. We'll go, we can go large, we can go island nations, and let's change the seed. So now we have all these different islands in here, and each one can be somewhat its own little kingdom or city. So you'll have your main one, and then you'll have little little cities after that. So I like to, to look around on these random generated seeds. This one doesn't have a whole lot of land mass in it. Uh, that first one was actually really good. That one is pretty good. That's got a big island there, a big island there, a big island here, and a couple little small ones. That one's technically an island, I think. All right, let's, uh, well, maybe not because it doesn't, it's not separated by the dark water. But let's try this one out. We'll go here, and we'll choose our banner. Let's go with the green 20-sided die. Name your kingdom. Uh, Martyville call it <laughs> Martopolis O-L-I-S Martopolis, it's a Martopolis oh, we can do custom banners oh, that's kind of cool so I could like have my little Marty face on the custom banner I didn't even realize you could do that alright, let's go ahead and accept alright, so now we can start and I'm going to pause I believe we're paused, right? nope, now we're paused Okay, the birds have stopped, although they're still kind of moving. All right, so the first thing we want to do is build ourselves a castle somewhere. So let's grab a keep, and let's get it over... Hmm, where's a good spot? So we've got some stone here. Do we have iron anywhere on this, this island? I don't think so. I think that's like a regular rock. That's a that's stone quarry. That's like a regular rock. Uh, what about over here? This might be the good one. This might be the one we start at. I think that would be that would be best. All right, so let's get this thing placed. I don't want to take up too much of this green because that's fertile land. So let's, well, I guess it really doesn't matter right now at this stage. So let's get this, like, centered right in there. There we go. Our keep is being built. We'll have to go to the town and get some hovels built. Although we don't have anything. Oh, we don't have roads. We need to get some roads first. It's been a little while since I played. Uh, so let's get a main road going. Oh my gosh. Let's get a main road going out through here. And we'll just do something like that for now. So also, let's close that down. Uh, we need to get some materials. So let's start designating some things to be chopped. And there's a hotkey. See? See? I still have to click it. Okay. Let's chop all that. Alright, so all these are being marked for chop. Let's get a whole bunch of that stuff done. Alright, stone quarry, stone quarry, iron quarry. Nice. Alright, so we should be set up great for doing uh, a bunch of stone stuff. There's a lot of quarries around here. Four of them. Okay, next up is we are going to build some things. So let's go hovels. And we're just gonna we're just gonna place them out and about here. Random directions, I guess. I guess that's all I can build for now. Until I get more wood. Speed it up a little bit. There you go, build yourselves some houses, people. Because right now there's nothing else for me to do. You've got some houses, you're happy. 
I like it. And how are we looking on wood? We've only got three wood. So now they've got homes. All right, back to chopping, everybody. Back to chopping. Get to work. And we should go food next. Farms cost three wood to build. And you can only build them on these green lands. If I try to do it here, it says naturally fertile or receiving irrigation. So we can't do that. Let's go ahead and get these things. Uh, I want to make sure I leave room for a road to go by. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, if we had a road turn here and go that way, then I'd be able to get all these lands too. So let's do here. Food, farm. There we go. Two farms should suffice for now, I hope. Alright, it says no one is available to work on new construction. Try closing non-essential buildings to free up workers and make new homes. Alright, let's close that. Can I close that down? Nope. Okay, I can change the name of my place though. Alright, it is winter time. And the seasons go by really quick in this game. Wood castle block. We can do the wood walls. Hovel still. Um, let's do couple more as soon as we get more um, more wood because they're building the farms now so that's a good sign all right we can change job priorities too which is really cool so the builders can go there timber workers see that we've got timber workers we can put that up the most important thing is to gather that but let's make it building uh, farming should be at least second farming should probably be first then builders, then timber workers, then stockpile workers. And the stockpile workers are just going to grab stuff and put them places. So let's close that. We have farmers now doing their job. Builders doing the second priority, right? And then if anybody's left over, they're going to do that. So if we have more homes, that means this thing will hold five villagers. Each one has five. So we have uh, two of them that are pretty much empty. So we have plenty of room for new people to move in because we've got five people down here in the bottom left and 15 beds. All right, good stuff. Okay, we just have to kind of wait now. Uh, let's just keep them going on that stuff. Let's see what we need to do next. Forrester is going to take 15 wood and 5 stone. Corey is going to take 15 stone wood. Um, so let's see, where can we get these things built? Uh, we are going to have to get a whole bunch of wood now. Three people found a satisfactory home and decided to stay and serve you. That is good. Three more people? Or no, that's still the same one. Three people there? Alright, good. So now we have eight. We have more people working. Let's see. Two in that. Four in that. Two, four. That's six. Where's the, uh, where are the other two? What are they doing? They're idle. What are they doing? Are they like heads of the household or something, not doing any work? All right, we have 14, 16 now, industry. Let's go to quarry. Okay, we need to get a road going up that way. So town, road. I want to get the road like right into here. Oh, good. We can, we can just run it right along. And then we have to get a whole bunch more wood now. All right, so let's go industry. Quarry is going to be here and... Is that going to be too close? Uh, is that going to work? You know what? Once they build that, I think it'll expand a little bit. And we should be good. The guy's just walking through stone. He's magic. Let's speed things up a little bit again. Still 10 wood. But they're grabbing all, they haven't chopped that. Once they chop that, we should be good. Industry. Dang it. 14. Okay, there we go. Quarry. We can get the quarry. Where's the stone one? Stone available quarry here. That's just regular unusable stone. All right, industry. Quarry. Boom. We now have nine people. That's good. All 
Alright, we need to chop some more trees here. That one's marked. Alright, we should be looking alright there. Still 15 beds and 9 people. Um, how are we doing on food? 25 of 50. Let's go with one more farm and we'll build it right there. At this point, I kind of want to keep it even, like one farm per house. All right, what's the next thing we want to do? I think the next thing is going to be forestry. So once we get this stone quarry up and running, we will do ourselves a little forestry spot. And I kind of like doing them in a certain way. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. Um... So I like having them all set up in kind of like a grid fashion almost. And you can't put anything down here because there's no trees. Unless I start here and then it populates an area and then I move it over and it populates another area. That might not be a bad idea. So let's see. If we go roads and come straight down. No more. No more. We're all out of wood. Y'all need to be chopping, guys. All right, quarry is open. We can get four workers there, although the priority is probably pretty low. So let's keep it that way. We've got 15 folks here. All right, so we do have uh, we have enough wood to get another hovel. So let's get another one of these set up right there. I can build one more. Let's do it. That's 10 more beds right there, guys. Alright, town. Road. And then industry. I wish I could just see the outline of it if I just clicked it, even though I can't build it. That way I can plan and wait until we get enough material. Alright, builders always build. They always got something going on. That means they can't do the quarry. Farm is ready to go. Harvested. Almost harvest time. There it is. Got 15 people. We're, we're hustling and a bustling. There we go. House is built. We have people working at the quarry now. Look at that. Look how close you can get with this game, too. It's got nice little shading, too. It's very simple. Low poly, I think they call that. Looks good, though. Nothing's really textured. It's just kind of shaded. I like it. Okay, 13 of the wood, 2 of the stone. We need 5 stone total. Alright, charcoal maker, we're not going to worry about that yet. However, we are getting stone, and that looks like it's fully, uh, fully stocked. Still just 2 stone. 4 stone. We're, we're looking better. I almost feel like it might be worth it to sacrifice the wood and build another quarry right there. So you can put like multiple quarries on one chunk of stone as well. Let's speed that up. Get this thing built, guys. No time for sitting around. Let's mark some more stuff for chopping. Twenty-one people. We're a quiet hamlet. Boom. There we go. Alright, look at that. Look at all this wood that we've got. Let's slow down speed here. Don't want to get too carried away. Uh, Forester. Alright, let's see. If we get this thing, we just need to catch just a little bit. So I could run this right here. We'll go right to there and run a road out. I think we can do it. Just one out. I think it was like here. Let's see if I can do this. And then we can get that there. And then we can do another one. 
We'll go like this. Forester. We'll kind of overlap them a little bit. Just a little bit. That's only going to be like one tile. So right off the very end, let's go with a road. And that can go there. There we go. We're wasting a bunch. We're not going to be able to use this water. So, but that's all right. At least it'll look nice and neat and organized. All right, look at that. Five stones still, 24 logs. Everything's looking well. Uh, speaking of well, we need to get one of these things made. Because things are going to start getting caught on fire. So I think maybe we can put a well like right here, right next to the road. Or maybe we put one right on this corner. That should cover all of that. The keep and these hovels. And this is just going to be true. Uh-oh. There's a dragon. Oh no. This is not good at all. Hopefully it's early enough in the game where he's just going to look and, and keep on moving. Uh-oh, he's like headed almost straight for the quarry. You might spot it and be like, oh, you know what? Let's burn it down to the ground. Oh, he's... Okay, well, he's just kind of looking around, I think, right now. I don't think he's really going to do anything. He's just going to keep on going. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what are you doing? Nope. Don't turn. Don't turn. Keep on moving. Keep on moving, dragon. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Okay. Where is he headed? Don't stop above the quarry. Okay. We're good. I think he's going to fly away. Fly away, dragon. All right. Let's get a well up here. That's going to cover the hovels. The keep. That can be built there. Castle. We're going to have to start thinking about some defense, guys. Um, what is the next thing? Cottage. That is 25 wood and 10 stone. All right. Uh, we have 21 people, 25 beds. Food. Small granary to store our food. And also, I want to get an orchard up. Mm. Let's build our uh, let's build our road out this way now. That should be good. Food. Oh, 15 wood for the orchard. I just need 15 wood. That's all we need. So now they're going to automatically chop wood, which is amazing. Um, farmers, builders, timber workers, stockpile. Let's go quarry above stockpile. There we go. Three, eight, three, two. We need more people. We need, like, another two houses. Or another one house to finish this. set on vibrate now okay uh food orchard let's get it in this more fertile land because it will yield more crop we can get that there so that is a thing <laughs> we have orchards i want to have an orchard a real life orchard just a small one i think it would be sweet um go out there and prune the trees <laughs> and then harvest my fresh apples i would love it that would be fun all right so now you can see that this is spreading so eventually this will become all forested but you can't place the the forester lodge if there's not at least one tree within its radius which is kind of weird because i mean they're just going to plant them anyway it's not like you have to have that one tree why don't you just go out and get a sampling somewhere and deal with it you know um okay so hovels I want to get a cottage, though. So we might have to wait a little bit. Uh, I don't know. Job priority. Timber workers, we have three. That is not even complete yet. So we are going to have to do another couple hovels, I think, to fully stock the quarry and the, the forester lodge when it happens. Is there something small I could stick in the middle? 
Or if I stick this, can I landlock them and... What just happened? Okay. We're a small village, everybody. Congratulations. Hope you guys enjoyed episode one. We made our way up to a small village. We have 25 people. And that is going to be it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. My name's Marty, signing out. Peace.